It's 52 past four. Good afternoon, Daily Vlog, and good afternoon, DLive. You want to say hello to DLive as well? Good day, DLive. Look at the DLive. Hey, what do you see here, folks? What do you see up there? Got my new studio monitors. These are not speakers. These are monitors. Now, this is specifically for mixing of music. That's um, material. We needed these. I've been trying to mix on the MacBook Pro and it's woeful. The MacBook Pro has a real weird bass issue. The 2019 16 inch MacBook Pro, terrible bass rumble. Nothing ever sounded clean. Just impossible to work with. There's a crackling noise going on there. Now I will just, I will just pause this video. This gentleman's I'm just pausing that there. I'm going to get out of there because we're midway through a video here and the video is talking about the sound that these monitors make when they're not even doing anything. Now there's an audible hiss. You cannot hear it because it's not switched on, but and I, I don't even think you've had to hear it if I even if I do switch it on. I'm going to switch them on here and turn this on. You'll see the light up there. So now they're powered up. What we'll do is we'll we'll get the we'll let the daily vlog watch this as well. Uh, sorry, the D Live. So we'll turn on this GoPro camera so they can see the back angle. So now we've got two GoPros going. You guys can see this. We can see this. I don't think you're going to be able to hear this, but I'll put this up to the tweeter anyway, and you'll see. I have no confidence that you heard that. I have absolutely no confidence. The GoPros have got a woeful mic as it begins. Let me just say, um, the position I'm in right now, this position, sitting here, now this is a bad example because I'm not actually using them right now, but sitting here, and I can't hear it over the MacBook Pro humming, but and I've got Kansas on, but if I'm sitting here at this distance away, which is just, that's in front of my nose, it's about three and a half feet in front of me, I can clearly hear that sound. I can hear that easily. Now, I'm not going to even try to hear it now because I'm streaming, but we've got so many things powered on, but that's that's what's going on. There's an audible noise from the tweeter of these. These are Rocket 7s, G4 Rocket 7s. We're learning about it from this um, video here on YouTube. This guy has made a video called, what's it called again? It's called, Why Are My Studio, Why Are Studio Monitors Noisy? That's what it looks like. So we're watching that now. I'm not expecting to get an ultimate resolution here today. I don't really care too much for it. All I'm saying is that I thought these would be dead silent unless you sent them a signal. Now I can unplug the XLR cables from my Element 46. They're plugged in right now. But if I unplug those, it makes no difference. There is still an audible hiss from these monitors. Um, is it gonna affect me in my mixing? Not so much, but is it upsetting? Yeah, a little bit. Is it going to be a showstopper to send them back? No. I'm just thinking, there's a couple of suggestions here in the chat. Chad saying um, you need to get a hum reducer. It also depends on your cable, if it's balanced or not. These are these are balanced XLR cables. This is about this, this system, the Element 46. Now the stream can't see this, but I'm using an Apogee Element 46 with the XLR out. These are balanced inputs, balanced cable outputs. That's not the issue, um, but I appreciate you asking that. Um, if there are voltage and frequency in AC, it's the frequency that's the issue. But there's no there's no switchable change. Like these are these are universal. They send the, they sell these 